Hello and welcome to your Wednesdays this morning. There is lots coming up today, isn't there? It's exciting. I would love to share you the chaos before those opening titles start. Yeah, you've got is no just idea. Genius. If press, if press red existed. Do you know what it is? It's the equivalent of you know when someone goes, I'm popping in to see you. Are you in? And they literally just pull up and there oh. they are, and you put everything in the oh. cupboard oh. and you go, kids, sit down, <laughs> everyone be still. You go, hello, come oh, in. Oh, do you know what? That's Tomorrow. It. We will record the panic before. <laughs> <laughs> that would be hilarious. They're saying an area, please yeah, don't. Yeah, no, exactly, never. Please don't. But it is Wednesday and it's an extra special day today because did you know today is One Direction Day? Come on, Come on everyone. Here's Rochelle solo because she was in a band. I can only do that. <laughs> That's all I've got in my life today. That's it. I need a tequila. Oh, I need a tequila. tequila, then you'll be fine. Tequila oh, fantastic. Good. Well, on this exact day back in 2010, we were introduced to Harry, Liam, Louis, Niall, and Zayn. <laughs> We just did that on telly. Yeah, wow, well, yeah, we did, didn't we? Okay, fine. <laughs> uh, we met them for the very first time as a five piece Zayn, Malik, Liam Payne, Harry Styles. Oh, my God. We've decided to put you both through the joke. <laughs> Look, they look so oh, young, no. don't they? Later, we'll be showing you some never-before-seen footage when they debuted as a band. Very excited about that. Oh, it's going to be awesome. Also, our Queen of Soaps, Sharon Marshall, is in the studio. Are you a directioner? Naturally. I mean, who is it? <laughs> I saw those moves. She's yeah, a directioner. Absolutely. <laughs> but you're not just here to talk about One Direction, are you? What's uh -huh. going on? I mean, there's a lot going on, as always, we in Soapland. We are going in One Direction only, and that is to the TV, because Cindy is back, and she's meeting her daughters and facing all the people who think she died 25 years ago and all the husbands she tried to murder. It's amazing. It's a lot of mopping up to do. It's like all on a Wednesday, <laughs> all on a Wednesday. Uh, now, something smells delicious in the kitchen. Phil, Philip, what's on the menu? My mother calls me Philip, yeah, which is in a bad mood. That was instantly like you got in trouble. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> what are you cooking? Schlitzel, here we go. You could schlitzel anything delicious, extremely good value for money, tasty, with a cherry tomato, spicy tomato dressing. Yeah. Oh, gorgeous. I, actually, I like mine to schnitzel in a sandwich. Oh, oh, I might yes. do a sandwich version as well. Yeah. Are you going to do that today? I might do. Because yeah. today's one of those days again where your food needs to be my lunch as well. No problem at all. <laughs> okay, fine. Just yes, you just elevated it. I was in for the chicken and then you went sandwich and we all went, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It works. Yeah. Trust yeah. Oh, no, I, I trust you. Of course it I trust does. you. Uh, also... I trust any man in an iron, an iron shirt. <laughs> Uh, excuse me, this is a bit of linen. Oh, yeah, linen. Linen never works on telly because it always looks creased. Well, tell that don't to me. Give me all I'm, that. I'm, I'm joining don't, you. Don't, don't I'm joining that. you no. in the linen. I, do you know, I actually think this is linen. That's not linen. <laughs> what are you talking about? Oh. Anyway, uh, beauty expert Nadine Bagger is also here. And you're finding out if those social media beauty hacks actually work, aren't you? I am. I'm looking at the coolest lasers, faux freckles fresh from TikTok, and LA's hottest fake tan. Oh, nice. OK, well, she's the nation's best-selling psychologist. And today, Dr Julie Smith's back. You're tackling social media and some of the anxieties it causes, aren't you? Uh, yeah, and that envy that we can all feel when we spend a lot of time on social media or perhaps following the wrong people. So, do you want us for that? Interesting. Thank you very much. And he's the gardening expert we all need in our lives. Alan Titchmarsh will be telling us how to prep our gardens ready for winter, as well as that he's talking about his brand-new book. But we're